Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. My name is Madison. Thank you so much for joining. Today I'm going to be doing my Sephora favorites breakdown here that I do on my channel. If you haven't seen any other ones, I will leave them linked up in the cards as well as the description box below. I am super excited. I actually have a couple different Sephora kits that I'm going to be doing right now. They're all the new ones that are on the app. I will leave them linked down in the description box below if you guys wanted to snag one up for yourself. So the first one I'm going to be doing here is the Fresh Squeezed Set. This retailed for $51 Canadian and $39. US and this is what it looks like here on the inside it's super cute all of the products are laid out right in front of you and there is a mask there at the back so like I did mention I paid $51 and this does come with 121 set value and basically what I'm gonna be doing is breaking down each individual product inside this kit letting you know if it is worth it or not as well as the sample value I really like doing these because they do have a said value sticker on here but I like to break it down myself to make sure that it is worth the price point now in this one there is three full-size item two travel size items and two small little samples here and like I said, this is the Fresh Squeeze Kit. The little description for this box is treat yourself with a fresh fruit boost of hydration. This fruit themed set includes a full size brightening face mask and other products that will leave you hydrated and nourished. So I'm going to get started right away and we are going to go with this guy. So in the kit, this is one of the full size items and this is the Milk Makeup Watermelon Brightening Mask. So like I said, this is full size. It retails for $34 and basically what it is, it's a solid mask infused with watermelon that will not only hydrate, nourish, but as well as brighten your skin. It's great for all skin types and skin tones. It has no sulfates and parabens as well as it is gluten free, cruelty and vegan free as well, which is really nice. And like I said, it is a solid mask in a stick form, which I think is really cool. So you just twist it up on the bottom here and there is a product right there. I'm just going to put some on the back of my hand so you guys can see what it looks like. And that's it right there. It does leave your skin a little bit colored and it does give it a nice cooling aspect, but it doesn't really smell like watermelon in my opinion. So this is a great added value into the box. It is full size and like I said, it retails for $34. So up next in the kit is the Sephora Dragon Fruit Lip Scrub, which I actually don't own and I'm really super excited about this item. So this is another full size item. This retails for $10 on the Sephora app. And basically what this is, is a lip scrub that's gonna prep your lips for either a lip treatment or as well as like matte lipsticks or any type of lipstick. I honestly love lip scrubs and I'm super excited to have this in my collection and it smells really really good so like I said this is full size and it adds $10 into our box so we're already at $44 and again I only paid 51 I just wanted to chime in here this mask has already dried on my skin which is really cool and it's only been a couple minutes so next up in the box we're gonna go with this little orange guy up here and this is the Ole Hendrix Truth Banana Bright Eye Cream. And our sample value that we got was 3 mils or 0.1 fluid of an ounce. So the full size equals $52. And this sample size, like I said, for 3 mils is retailed for $10.40. So this little cream here is gonna target fine lines as well as wrinkles and it's gonna help brighten up your under eye. That's gonna help for the application of concealer, which is really cool. Doesn't really have a smell there, which is something that I do like because I don't like a lot of added fragrances in my products. So I am super excited to try this. So next up, we're gonna grab this guy up here, which is this green one. This is the Glow Recipe Avocado Melt Retinol Sleeping Mask, which is super cool. I don't own anything, I think, by Glow Recipe, so this is really cool to have in the box. So the full size of this product is $66. So the sample that we received is 10 mils, which is 0.3 of a fluid ounce, which retails for $9.40. So this mask right here is made with avocado as well as encapsulated retinol and a PHA which will help nourish and calm the skin as well as help controlling blemishes. So I'm really super excited to have this in my collection and I cannot wait to use it. So next up in here, we're gonna grab this bad boy, which is a Marc Jacobs product. I absolutely love the container on this. This is so unique and different. So like I said, we now have the Marc Jacobs Youth Quake Hydrafull Retexturizing Cream Gel. Now this is one of the products that really caught my eye in this whole kit and one of the reasons why I wanted to purchase this kit. The full size of this bad boy is $79. So the sample value that we received, which is 
15 mils and 0.5 fluid ounce. Retails for $23.70. I think that's pretty crazy for this little amount of product, but I'm super excited because it's retexturizing, at least it claims to be. It has pineapple enzymes, which is one of the things that helps retexturize your skin, and it does apparently have a tropic scent, which is something that I am super excited. I don't like a lot of scents, but like tropical, like hello, yes. I don't really smell that much. Obviously, I'm just smelling it from the container, not necessarily applying it on my face, but I am super excited to try this, and this is something that's going to really help even out everything to make sure that it'll be great for makeup application. Next up, we have the Too Faced product here, which was another one of the reasons why I wanted to pick up this set. And this is the Too Faced Primed and Peachy Cooling Matte Skin Perfecting Primer infused with peach and sweet fig cream. Again, I'm not 100% on scents, but I do like a little bit, if that makes any sense. I'm a girl, you know, it's very hit and miss. Some days I want it, some days I don't. Um, so this feels like a pore filling primer, to be completely honest. Um, it is very sticky. Oh my god, that does smell really good though. It does definitely have that cooling effect. The second I put it on my hand right here, I could definitely feel the coolingness. So the full size of this primer is $45, and we received a product for 20 mils or 0.67 of a fluid ounce, which means this travel size is retailed for $22.50, but Sephora actually sells a travel size for $21.50, so it is a dollar extra in my mathematical equation that I have figured this out for ounces versus price. Um, so you definitely can pick this up. I'm assuming at like the Sephora checkout line or like obviously online, it'll show the full size as well as like a travel that you can purchase. So this is a primer that claims to blur, smooth, and brighten your skin. And apparently it lasts 16 hours and has a 12 hour shine control. Again, this is my first time just trying it on my hand here, so I'm not too sure. If you guys do have any results or anything, let me know it down in the comment section below and let me know if it did last the 16 or 12 hours. I normally have a combination skin, so I'm oily in my tea, and I am dry everywhere else. Let me know if this is something I should try. And then last but not least in this set here is a Sephora face mask, and this is full size. This retails for $8, and this is the Ultra Hydrating and Brightening Lychee Face Mask. I do love Sephora's face masks. I have several of them. I really like how simple and easy they are and how they leave my skin feeling after. I have never tried this one, so I was super excited that it was in this fruit-filled box. So like I said, this is the moisturizing and brightening one. I'm super excited to try this, and I know that the Sephora face mask, or at least most of them, are vegan, which is really great. And now this has added an extra $8 into the value of our box. So here gets the good part. Again, I paid $51 for this box. The sticker on the box said it had $120 value. After my calculations, I received $118 value, so just a $2 difference, which isn't much, but you are getting a $67 added value into this box. So I highly recommend picking up one of these if you can. I love the Sephora sets, especially if you are wanting to dabble into a little couple items. This fruit-filled box was amazing, and if you were thinking of about getting one of the full-size items, you might as well purchase the box because you are getting all these added goodies into it as well. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. If you aren't already, click that subscribe button before you leave. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you had any other Sephora favorite kits that you would like me to break down and give you my opinion on, comment down below in the comment section, and I do have two more Sephora sets coming your way. Bye!